Hello class. In this assignment, this is assignment number nine, and in this assignment, we are dealing with construct sentence using idioms. Idioms. It is a part and parcel of our any language. Idioms enhance the creativity, the beautiness of any language. It is a diamond. It is a necklace of each and every language. so because in idioms in a very simple word in a very less words it express a variety of meaning very deep expressive meanings so idiom work as a necklace diamond jewels of any language so let us discuss the various idioms and its use in our day to day conversations so construct sentence using idioms the main objects the main aims of this assignment is that students should know what is the idioms its meaning and they should practice the same idioms in your own sentences next practical significance practical importance english language is a rich in idioms which makes communication very effective idioms are the sayings which introduce principles and values of culture of society use of figurative language can make communication more effective okay english language is rich in the form of idioms in english language there are lot of idioms are used for making effective communication idioms are the sayings these are the proverbs these are the sayings which introduce principles and values of culture and society use of figurative language can make communication more effective they provide for expressive communication and a way for different people to say the same things but with different circumstances with different circumstantial allusions idiomatic expressions are so frequently encountered in both spoken and written discourse that it requires special attention in language programs and should not be neglected to a position of secondary importance in curriculum use of figurative language is essential to communicate in english in spoken and written forms okay so figurative language is very important to express our ideas they provide expressive communications and a way of different people to say the same things but in different circumstances different circumstantial allusions idiomatic expressions are so frequently encountered in both spoken and written discourse it requires special attention in language programs and we should require it relevant to program outcomes basic knowledge is required communication is required lifelong learning is required relevant course outcomes formulate grammatically correct sentences compose dialogues and paragraph for different situations use relevant words as per the context practical learning outcomes construct sentence using idioms practical skills use computer system including language software develop listening speaking and writing skills relevant effective domains are follow safety practices demonstrate working as a leader or individuals minimize theoretical background the knowledge of vocabulary sentence constructions basic writing skills required the basic techniques of express ideas and emotion is essential practical setup you know the practical setups procedure you know the set procedure that open the language lab software login in your know, account read the instruction carefully and uh, read the various idioms and its meanings listen carefully and use the same idioms in your own sentences precautions you know the precautions safety guidelines handle headphone uh, carefully and do not insert pen or your memory card in labs let us see in this assignment you just write 20 idioms its meaning along with your own sentences
in examination the same things so let us discuss ideals means it is a figurative form of language it is a jewel it is a proverbs it is a saying which is comes from and sector to us and it provide a beauty ness to the language and native speakers are usually use idioms in their conversations so as a master of any language we should use idioms of a, in a specific language because idioms have a power that gives a lot of expressions variety of expressions in different manner in simple word it express different different ideas and thoughts same thing but in different manner by different peoples it is features of idioms let us discuss idioms write the sentence using idioms in dotted lines in a nut cell in a nut cell means in brief just tell me the story in a nut cell manner in a nut cell manner matlab in brief at the outset means in the beginning made me a mistake at the outset means make the mistake at the beginning a bosom friend means close friend i treat him like a bosom friend in full swing at the height the college football season is now in full swing hit the hay go to bed means sam has hit the lay take a rest in the dark in a state of ignorance in a dark means don't know anything they kept me in the dark about their plans seven true to the salt do not deceive don't be deceived the maratha soldiers were true to their salt in the battlefield no one deceived them because they performed their duty for the sake of stop smoking for the sake of my health in favor of in the benefit of in a state of due to financial loss we was he was in a depressed state of mind a depressed state of mind in the mind of thinking process look forward to look forward to future next tense look out for don't think like this turn down please turn down the gas to lay down the lay down under the shade of a tree take a rest lay down means take a rest get your walking papers you are fired get your walking papers means you are fired you had better keep you had better keep your character clean or you are going to get your walking papers you had better keep your character clean or ready to face the fire by all means don't make money by all means means all the sources piece of cake a job a task or other activity that is easy or simple example daily exercise is a piece of cake for my brother with one voice with one voice unanimously with one voice means unanimously shreyas was selected as the class representative with one voice 17th sit on the fence this is used when someone does not want to choose or make a decision okay crucial decisions important decisions example a few employees often sit on the fence in a critical situations still someone's thunder to take the credit for something someone else did okay take the credit for something someone else did example mrs neha still someone's thunder and boast of herself 19th once for all finally once for all my daughter finished with all her school projects 20 at a stretch continuously we have been working on the task 
at a stretch means continually in this way we can write yeah, you can use idioms means proverbs means saying ritual saying ritual saying in your day to day conversations i hope you can and understand the idioms idioms means proverbs saying which is used by native speaker and it glorify beautify the language okay idioms have power to express more things in a simple words and it provide the variation of the language so practice it and write the same things in your assignment number i think so 13 or 14 13th idioms hope you can complete it thank you